outlook on endangered species. Every time you lose a species, the world is diminished. Uh, they're kind of like separate nations or different tribes. They should be respected and all the animals are part of the web of life. We're supposed to be here to be the caretakers of the planet. I really disagree very strongly with the attitude of the fundamentalist or the bush crowd that believes that we're here to use up the resources before God comes again, before Jesus returns again. That is such an evil, Tolkien, uh, Sauron-like attitude. I can't believe it. If you lose a species, we are diminished. We're supposed to be the, the voices for the animals. We're the ones to make sure that they're protected and cared for. We're their caretakers and brothers. We're not supposed to use them up and throw them away like a tissue. I feel that the reason why they're being endangered is because most of them are being used for uh, selfish needs and wants because people want to show off how cool they are and they think that since they can take something that they have to when they don't need to and they're using more than what is supposed to be used and that they use God for selfish acts and I don't think it's cool at all. I believe in its truest form, it's Darwinism. The strong survive and the weak really do not. In fact, I think we should eat the endangered animals. I don't believe it's too big of a deal. The thing I don't think that we completely understand is how complex the web of life is. I mean, there's species coming in and out probably a lot more than we realize. Those that we are a direct cause of is a tragedy and we shouldn't do it. We need to limit ourselves. We can change our diet. We can change the density of our population base. We don't need to, to live in such a way that we overstress the environment and uh, wipe out the species. Sometimes that we are at fault or responsible and I think that that's a tragedy that we should never, ever perpetrate or at least repeat. Yeah, I do believe that we are the cause, but I think we could ultimately be their destruction. I think the majority of that is us because we're taking them for exotic foods, um, clothes, and some of them is because of the food chain. We have the breeding program, some of those things that goes on in, in zoos to help breed um, endangered species. We could set aside preserves for them, like the mountain gorillas. Do we really need to go everywhere? Do we really need to take and use up everything? No, we don't. We could uh, change our technology to go a lot more green, use the wind, the solar, uh, geothermal, change our away from fossil fuels, and change our idea that we don't have to have and use everything. I don't like zoos. I think sometimes bringing them in would help them only they should only be used to help an uh, animal get back to health. What they're mostly used is for entertainment. It's not their environment no matter how much you ape it, how much you imitate it, and it's depressing for them. 